You want a big butt? Hustle and right behind that hustle. You need muscle, must day. Can't hold me down, they can't hold me down. Can't hold me down. I'm about to go in, taking over that crown. Headphones on, then my stomping ground. Caught a chest work that's pound for pound. When I'm in the zone, don't make a sound. Myself, I have found trapped in beast mode. Beauty of it, we go. Crazy like on C low. No need to boost my ego. Need no need negativity. But these haters ain't nothing but my energy. <laughs> What's good, MHMG fam? It's your boy, the Jizzle Man, aka K Jizzle, aka Get Em Gains, aka Mr. Easy Money. Not in that order, but you get it. Alright, today is a video that I'm making for my homegirl. I ain't gonna put your name out right there, you know what I'm saying? But you gonna know, you feel me? And it's about how to, to develop a bigger or more firm tone buttocks. Or should I say gluteus, gluteus maximus and along with the gluteus maximus, okay, let's get serious for a minute. Along with the gluteus maximus, which is the biggest muscle in the human body, if you didn't know, you want to make sure that the gluteus medius, which is like right up in here, okay, I ain't going to show my butt, nothing like that, but you get the picture, like right up in here, and your gluteus minimus, which is the the little small muscle right here that connects to your hip is also tight and strong along with the gluteus maximus. Gluteus, I don't know why I keep putting the M in there. Gluteus, that's my country shit. Gluteus maximus, okay? All right, so first thing for gluteus maximus, all right? To get that toned up, you do your basic exercise, okay? I got all my notes and stuff right here, so I'm gonna be reading off the notes a little bit because I wanna make sure I give you the proper and most informed information. You dig? All right. So, you glue this maximum. First thing first, squats. Everybody know what squats is. Okay, you don't have to look and put weight on there. You can do regular body weighted squats, you know what I'm saying? You can do, uh, you can do squats with the weights. Or you can do squats with dumbbells. And when I mean, you know what I'm saying, you hold the dumbbells to your side like so, you know what I'm saying, and you squat down like this. I can't really do it, I got all this bench in my way, but you, you did what you did, you feel me? All right, next thing, one leg squats, okay? Now this bench is gonna come in handy for a second, okay? One leg squats. You can use a bench, or you can do it like you're doing lunges, okay? One leg squats. Uh, uh, you feel that all up in there? All up in that gluteus, man. Matter of fact, let me do it on this side. Okay, go down, uh, squeeze up. You don't need no weight. You're gonna feel that in your gluteus maximus and in your gluteus medius, okay? Next thing is lunges, okay? Walking lunges, bow, you know what I'm saying? Bow, the basic, you know what I'm saying? Lunges, or, and lateral lunges, okay? So that's, uh, uh, tutorial video on me. Alright, so that's for your maximums. Alright, your medias, hip adductors. Nothing laid down on the floor, okay? I don't know what the fuck on this floor here. But pretty much, you land on your side, hand about right here, feet together, uh, you're coming up, okay? And if you've seen like any videos on YouTube or something like that, third girl, some people they put the ankle weights on their weights. Some people don't. Some people use the bands. You can use the bands. You can use the resistance bands. You can use the band that is tied around like that. Or you can use the resistance band tied around one foot and just go up like that, okay? Like I said, tutorial video on the way. All right. One leg squats, of course. Lateral band walks. One leg deadlifts. You don't know what one leg, leg deadlifts is? Quick tutorial. All right. And I'll be having one more in depth tutorial later on down the line, which is just get the dumbbell. Go down and come back up. All right, so that's for your, your medius, okay, and also for your, your minimus, okay, which is very, very important and people seem to neglect it a lot, all right. There's really, when you're doing all these other exercises, the really thing about the, the, the minimus is your posture, your form, okay. So most people, when they do stuff, you know, they kind of arch back like this or whatever, whatever. That's not what you really, I mean, you want to arch back, but you really want to kind of squeeze some hips in just a little bit, okay? Squeeze some butt cheeks, especially for you ladies, because you're trying to build up butts up. And then when you squat, you come down and you come back up, all right? That'll save a lot of lower back pain and it'll save somewhat pain in your knees, you know what I'm saying? As long as you're not going very, very heavy 
when you're doing these exercises, okay? My cameraman get on the time, so I'm gonna go ahead and wrap this video up. All right, time for more shot of the guy, you know what I'm saying? All right, so like I said, you wanna work on those, those subtle little movements, hip reductors, one leg squat, one leg deadlifts, squats, okay? Also, you wanna build up those hamstrings as well because as we know, the body is one organism, you know what I'm saying? Or, or, or organ, one complete organ, and everything is attached to everything. So your hamstring is attached to your glutes, your glutes is attached to your lower back, your lower back, your lats, your traps, your shoulders, your delts, all the way through your whole body, okay? So central nervous system, you want to make sure your lower back is strong, so you might want to do certain subtle little things like uh, back extensions, okay? Not what everybody low, low weighted. So rudely interrupted by, by the maintenance lady that works here. You know what I'm Stalker. All right. So you want to make sure you do hamstring work, okay? Because that's connected to your glutes. Lower back work, like back extensions, which is also going to help with your hamstrings, which is also attached to your gluteus maximus. All right. And lightweight deadlifts, certain things like that. Also, also work on your posture. As we all know. You should be able to stand up against the wall, okay, your head, your shoulders, your butt, your calves, all the way to your heels, you should be, now I'm a little big nowadays, so I'm going to brag a little bit, but you should be able to stand to the wall like this, and your posture should be straight, okay, that'll also help you work on your gluteus minimus, so if you just take two minutes out your day, maybe two, three times a week, Work on your posture, make sure your form and your posture is right. That will also help, okay? And engage your core. Make sure your core is strong when you're doing these exercises. And that will also, also, whether you believe it or not, help you build a bigger, firmer butt, okay? All right, so. I just wanted to do this video for home girl and for all the other girls out there in the world who are trying to build a, build a bigger butt. Make sure you focus on all the components of the butt. Gluteus maximus. <laughs> put that M in there. Gluteus maximus, gluteus minimus, and gluteus medius. Okay? I love y'all. Peace. <laughs>